So hey guys, I know it's been a while since I've been um, posting something on this channel that's kind of worthy of watching. <laughs> Anyhow, uh, uh, I've been mainly doing videos, we've been mainly doing videos, me and Alicia, over on our youtube.com forward slash F-O-J-C-T-V. So that's basically fans of Jimmy Century, the abbreviation of it. Uh, F-O-J-C-T-V, uh, that link's in the description. And go over there and check those videos out and you can check out our music stuff and just some of the other goofy stuff we've been doing during all this uh, whole pandemic crisis. Uh, and anyhow, um, but today I'm actually going to be uh, upgrading my MacBook Pro 5.1. It is a 3.46 uh, pro uh, processor, 6 core, and we're going to change that to a 12 core, 3.46 processor. And, um, and I'm going to show you how easy it is. It's basically, you turn it off, pull the tray out, put the new tray in, and then you have a 12 core. And uh, I'm going to go through that right now. And I got my, uh, my new 12 core. It's down here in the box. I'm going to bring it up here. I haven't unpacked it. I will be unpacking it soon. It's right here. I just got it in the mail. I got it off of eBay. Uh, it was about $760 or that off eBay. Um, I'll put a link in the description. The guy's price changes. I got it when he had it lower. Um, sometimes it goes up to like 800 and something, but I think there's an offer on it too. And my six core, I have um, 64 gigs of RAM. I'm gonna have a lot more than that in this one, but let's get to it. So. All right guys, so here's what I'm starting with. Uh, this is my Mac Pro as it is right now, which is a six core, uh, 3.46, uh, processor and I'm running uh, the 10.14.6 Mac on it. It's a 2010 and it has got 64 gigs of RAM and we are going to upgrade it to this right here. Let me get it in focus which is a 12 core 2012 3.46 processors 2012 and you can actually double the RAM so I don't have the double RAM yet but we're gonna put the tray in and uh, we're gonna take this tray out and I'm gonna show you how easy it is to just remove your tray and upgrade all right all right so the first thing you want to do is close your computer down so make sure you have all your programs closed down I have two monitors so I just want to go down here and just click quick quit nobody else to have open um, Firefox quit Close that. X air, close it. Empty my trash. Close those. All right, close that. And I'm going to shut my computer down. All right, so now let's pull out the brand new 12 core. Sit on the pop bubbles. In fact, it looked really good. And I got a keep all this packing because I'm going to sell my six core and I want to make sure I can put this all back the way it was the six core so even though that little thing open that up keep this bag oh, there's something underneath here oh that's my my receipt so the whole thing came out with the eight hundred and twenty-nine dollars with tax to upgrade from a six core to a twelve core. But I can sell my six core for about four hundred. So it's only really costing me four hundred and twenty dollars. Oh wow! This came with RAM. Uh, this wasn't supposed to come with RAM. I have no idea how much RAM this came with. But we are going to find out. So this is the tray, all right? And this is what, all I gotta do is slide the other tray out. Just gotta pop these two little things out, pull it out, put this one in, and I'll have my other one. So let's do that right now. All right guys, glad to come on the table. First thing you wanna do when you do this is you wanna make sure that you unplug your power supply. You know, just so you don't get any electrical stuff going on. And unplug any other. You don't really need to unplug anything here because that's not part of the actual tray. So to get the tray out, 
There's nothing included except for popping these two little things in. Now I just go like that, pull my tray out, grab my brand new tray with the ram in it. So then you just slide this back in, pop your little two things out. Those are the locks. And then push them in, close your locks down, plug your power supply back in. And now I just upgraded my Mac 5 comma 1 from a 2010 6 core, uh, was it um, 3.46 I believe it was, to a 12 core 2012 3.46. And turn on. All right, so we have restarted my new computer. And I got to put in my password, still the same password because your hard drive's never changed. And all your operating system and everything is still exactly the same. Bam! Look at that. Uh, that's my NVIDIA driver. I want to update it back to an NVIDIA card. We don't have it in there. I didn't see here's a screenshot I took of the, of the old stuff. Whoops. Here's my old screenshot. My uh, my 2010 3.46 gigahertz, 64 gigs of RAM, and uh, now we're gonna open up what it is now so about this Mac. Uh, it's supposed to be a 2012. I'm gonna have to contact them, but it is. There's two. There's two 3.46 six cores, that means 12 cores, and it, it gave me 16 gigs of RAM. All right, I gotta look on there and see what I bought, because I don't think that's right. Okay, so I called the, I got a hold of the company, and they actually explained to me that that is a 2012 and how to prove it, and then uh, that if you put a 2012 uh, shelf in a 2010, computer it'll still come up as 2010 so that makes sense so right now uh, the the RAM that came okay I, I bought this with no RAM they actually sent me 16 gigs of RAM which is complete junk uh, that was on there uh, what is it eight twos so I'm gonna take that out put my 64 gigs of RAM in there and then I have 64 more gigs of RAM on order that will be here soon so I'm gonna unplug the power supply again and I'm going to remove the tray that I just bought so I can get to all the RAM. And I'm going to remove these four. Take them out and then turn it around. these four bunch of DDR2s that I'm sure they probably just didn't want so they sent them to me to be cool but uh, that way they didn't have to dispose of them all right and I'm gonna turn this back around and get my old six core that I'm gonna sell <clears throat> and take out the 64 gigs of RAM see with the six core there is only four slots so you can only have 64 gigs of RAM you know there's not not eight slots on there but on the 12 core there are eight slots of RAM four here and four in the back. So now I'll put the 64 gigs of RAM right back in here and then I get my other four gigs. When I get my other 64 gigs of RAM I will put that in when it gets here. Then I'll have a little double my RAM in that one-handed. And so 
right now these are these are 16 gig uh, uh, 2RX4 PC3 um, what's that 12800R so um, anyhow I'm going to upgrade that as soon as I get the rest of the RAM Alright, now I got my 64 gigs of RAM back, put my tray back in. Put those back in. Put this bad boy back in. And let's start her up. There it is. Heard the chime. So there it is, it's back up. We're gonna restart it and reset the PRAM a few times. And so I'm just going to click on restart. And we're going to go down to our keyboard. And as soon as we hit the chart, hear the chart, we're going to hit option command R and P. And hold that down until we hit three charms, which is going to take a while. That's just because we put everything new in there. We're going to make sure we clear out all the old junk. All right, guys. So here, are three chimes. Got rid of my. There's my old six core and my twelve cores in the machine. We've reset the PRAM by hitting um, Option Command R and P and holding that down for three chimes. I'll fast forward over that part so you're gonna hear all that. Screen just came back on. Here we go. And let's see what we got. And type in my handy dandy password all right boots back up Gotta close all that stuff sorry again I used to have an Nvidia card in here I took it out that's why that pops up and we go up to uh, Apple and about this Mac and there we go you can see I have uh, uh, Mojave it's 2010, which is a 2012 tray. Uh, it's it's two um, 3.4 six cores in there, which gives me 12 cores at uh, two 3.4, and I have 64 gigs of RAM, soon to be upgraded to what 138. All right. So, all right, guys, that's it. That's my upgrade for my uh, six core. Mac 5,1 to my 12 core Mac 5,1. Uh, hope that helps you guys out. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have any questions, leave them in the description. Also, check out our band's channel at youtube.com forward slash FOJC TV. Sayonara! Hey guys, it's Victor. And it's Alicia from Fans of Jimmy Century. Can you guys do us a mondo favor and go over and subscribe? to our YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash FOJC TV. We'll tell you why later. Later! later.